Yeah, which is really surprising. I mean, you know, Dewan Blair does a great job of rebounding, but most of his rebounds come off of the defensive end. And I thought Sam Young would be able to contribute a lot more on the offensive end. But, you know, that's been Levance Fields with 13 points in the first half, including three three-pointers. But Sam did his share. We'll get the drive and the dunk. He wound up with 15 first-half points. Well, it almost was like Jamie Dixon said, okay, Sam, it's starting to, time for you to start scoring. Right now, Levance Fields is carrying the load. We need some more point production out of you and he gave it to him well, that was jordan campbell there he had a couple of three-pointers and also with a three-pointer was andy wick he had two three-pointers in the first half but the panthers still managed to squeeze out the lead behind the play of sam young and both teams are back on the court and we're going to be set for the second half shortly beautiful drive and finish that time by jermaine dixon Statistically, it looks like this. See the difference Curtis talked about in the rebounding. As I mentioned, only four offensive boards for the Panthers today. Well, that's one area that they're going to have to improve the second half. And, you know, I don't anticipate that Belmont is going to shoot 37% this second half. I think they're starting to get into their groove a little bit. They're running that flex offense. They're starting to find guys a little better on the perimeter. Not a lot of difference in the turnover situation. And the Panthers with six three-pointers and just five three-pointers for Belmont. But you can bet they're going to stay behind that white line. That's the new distance as they add a foot to it. The blue line is still there because the women play from the old three-point distance. Right. McGee got to start tonight in the absence of Dewan Blair, who had some swelling on his knee. And there you see the big fella, or fella as they call him. Got a little limp to his step. Now, that's one of the few times I haven't seen him smile. Uh, whenever he plays a basketball game, he's all smiles. Yes, he is. And the first time on the court in the regular season for Gilbert Brown, a guy that's been waiting for a while to get his chance. We've got 20 more minutes of basketball. There's that smile. And the Panthers are being tested for the very first time this season, Curtis. They won their... First four games rather easily over Fairleigh Dickinson, 86-63. Beat Miami of Ohio, 82-53. Akron, 86-67. And IUP, 86-60. And they've got Texas Tech coming up on the 28th. The game will be played in Newark, part of the Legends Classic. Well, I anticipate Pitt not only this year, but traditionally has been a second-half team under the leadership of Jamie Dixon. They've always come out and gave more of an effort on a defensive end in the second half, and the point production is usually better the second half. And the Oakland Zoo is on hand doing their thing, as always. Belmont will go with the same starters that they began the game with. House, Dotson, Wick, Harris, and Campbell. Uh, I guarantee you we'll see some of Mr. Renfro before too long. It'll be Belmont basketball. Second half is underway. Three-pointer on the way. Bending out. Tracked down by Levance Fields. Goes behind his back. So crafty with the ball. Wanamaker getting the start in the second half of Pittsburgh, along with Dixon, Young, and Big. I think Jamie Dixon decided to go with a smaller lineup the second half to guard the perimeter a little better. Tied up was Levance Fields, hits the deck, turns the ball over. In the lane, bending it in off the glass, and good is Keaton Belcher. It is his second field goal, and now it's a four-point game. I think he closed his eyes on that. I think he did, it. Curtis. But he knew where the backboard was anyway. It counts. Fields, Dixon, Young, Wanamaker getting the start in the second half, as we mentioned, in, in place of uh, McGee. Young, baseline jumper good. There's their go-to guy. 17 for Sam. Nice assist by Fields. Three-pointer from the corner. Too strong. Dixon with a rebound for the Panthers. He'll start back. Left-handed dribble. Sets up in the corner to Wanamaker. They tried to go inside to Young. Couldn't hang on. Out of bounds. So second turnover early on in the second half for the Panthers, who lead by six. Interesting story about Rick Bird. 
after practice yesterday. Excuse me, after practice today. Good backdoor play and a nice finish with the left hand by House. 